Joining us now, Lee Merriweather, Miss America, 1955. Phyllis George, Miss America, yeah. 1971. Susan Powell, Miss America, 1981. The current Miss America, Katie Stamm, and our own Debbie Turner Bell, yeah. Miss America, 1990. <laughs> Might be letting a cat out of the bag. I don't know how many people knew I was Miss America around here. They know I'm now. The <laughs> they yeah, know that's now. Right. That's but right. I've got the crown to prove it, baby. <laughs> <laughs> this was so interesting. Just listening to you all, looking at the clips, and saying, "Oh, that was so and so, and that was so and so, and that was so and so." <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. For it to be on television first time, there's nothing to compare it to. Right. But when you walk down the street in the days afterwards, what was it like for you? It, it was it was amazing that so many people did watch the show and they did recognize me. Now it's a totally different story, but right. <laughs> no, it's not. No, it's, it's not. Well, yeah, it's yeah. You're sweet. a star in yeah. film yeah. and yeah. stage. Yeah. Well, and went to, yeah. Yeah. went to the Today I Show, right? Went to the Today Show. You worked right at the Today, Today show, show with Dave Garraway mm -hmm. for several oh, years. Yeah, right. Some of us actually remember. Thank you. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. That era. That era. Right. Your heart. Yeah. Jones. Yeah. And. Man, you were you were on the NFL today yes. here on CBS. We're very proud of you. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, no women were doing Breaker. anything. Don't with make me cry, Harry. With sports, <laughs> right? No, it was it Huge. was way early, like seventy three, seventy four. Yeah, I did it for ten years. Yeah, got married during that time and had two children during that time. And people are still, I still can't believe I did it yeah. back then. What was I thinking? I need to pay the rent, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. But I did want to get into broadcasting. I was so a was radio good. reporter in 1978. I went to the Super Bowl in New Orleans and crawled through a crowd. The one interview that I had to get was with Phyllis <laughs> George. Because oh. this was the biggest deal there was. There's a big documentary coming on the legend of Jimmy the Greek, and we relive all oh of those God. years. Wow. It's on wow. ESPN next yeah. Tuesday. I wow. saw Jimmy the Greek wow. in his hotel room during that Super Bowl, and he had a wad of, wad of money this big. And a bunch oh, wow. of gold chains around Yeah, exactly neck. right. Oh, All right, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Susan, I yeah. remember when she was crowned. I was mm -hmm. sitting at home, yeah. and she sang the telephone aria. Is that mm -hmm. what you call it? Mm -hmm. Incredible, incredible voice. Still sings mm -hmm. to this day. Mm -hmm. She's one of Sing the earliest Miss America. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Everything. Everything. She is really <laughs> outstanding. I mean, what a voice comes out of this little body. Hmm. Yeah. It really was. That so was your was era. Really was that anything. era of performance, though. Yeah, it really was. One year after another, somebody's playing the piano right. and someone's singing yeah. opera. Well, it was. It was. It had to do a lot with, I think, point system. I mean, at that time, um, Miss America, uh, fifty percent was for talent. Fifty percent mm -hmm. of the yeah. points. Look, there I am. Yeah. And watch, my hair doesn't move. <laughs> <laughs> Era of hairspray. Your friends stayed on and mine fell off. Well, I don't, I don't know, Phyllis. Perhaps we should talk about that. I know, but, and I no. had to carry it. <laughs> it was a. It was. It's a great tradition of which to be a part. Mm -hmm. yeah. You know what was neat, Harry, mm -hmm. is that mm -hmm. each of the ladies here represents not only a different era of the Miss America pageant, right. but it parallels what women were doing in society oh, mm -hmm. at that time. The pageant has grown mm -hmm. as women have grown right. in our society. Mm -hmm. And so we we have all these very articulate, gracious, beautiful women, except for me, I'm just straggling along. Oh, with oh, right. Right. Yeah. 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 Well, I mean, no, but truly representative of how women were viewed mm -hmm. in society. Now we have Katie, our contemporary, Miss America. Look at, yeah. that's you. That's, that's you, kid. Yeah. Yeah. Right? Yeah. 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 Nobody really, really, nobody really knows, knows right. that Miss America, they see yeah. the crown, like we have the crowns here today and everything, but really and truly we were all talking in the green, green room about how happy we were to have the scholarship money provided. Debbie became a veterinarian. I majored in a vocal music at, at, in Oklahoma City mm -hmm. and and all these I women. Were, we get about 45 yeah. million a year in kind. Uh -huh. yes. right. And we were, we, were the win, we were the winners and th there yeah. are millions of other stories of girls who don't go yeah. on to win but who go to school because of it. We're the Kate. largest mm -hmm. source of scholarship for and women And we have talent, world. a platform mm -hmm. scholarship. We're very different right. from some of the other because uh, the platform became a very big deal. Did, now, do they still do the platform now? They absolutely yes. do. Yeah, and what was yours? Mine is promoting community service and involvement. Mm -hmm. And I believe Gretchen Carlson, 1989, the year before Debbie, was really the, the that first was the year. That was the beginning with of the Actually, platform. I was the first. My, my year was the first Gretchen to have the official 
fir- the my viewer right. was the first year to have yeah. the official title, but yeah. many Miss Americas, even back to Lee, yeah, had absolutely. causes, had issues mm-hmm. that mm-hmm. they believed in. So Miss America was never just a pretty face after the 20s. It started off to be a pretty mm-hmm. face and a beautiful body. Right. But these were all women with brains in their heads. Do they still do the talent competition too? We then? absolutely and do. What, and, and it's still 35% of your overall score. So right. it's still, talent is yeah. still very important because that's what separates Miss America from everything else. That and the fact that we are a Look scholarship program. And Katie, in this in contemporary age, not only had to compete in the pageant, but she and her fellow contestants had to go through a reality show before. We did. Yeah, the they really of time. That was a lot yeah, of fun. Yeah, there's a reality show. Thank goodness we had didn't have to tell you uh, that. Uh, Do you know that in 2011, <laughs> this program will be 90 years old? Wow. 2011, 90 years old. We're so proud so of that. So did Bert Parks sing to you? He sang uh, to Sharon K. Ritchie. I, okay. uh, I, uh, but I was the first one to have the song sung to me, sung but it to. was on Philco Television Playhouse. I was given the opportunity to be on, <laughs> on the golden age of television right toward right, the end of right. it. And they had written a show for me, uh, Run Girl Run, and then they wrote another one, The Miss America Story, and right. Okay, uh, any guesses as to who sang the song to me on the show with the Miss America story? Oh, Bob Hope. No. Mm -mm. He had a strip of gray hair, and he was a singer. (sighs) Rudy Valley? Johnny Desmond. Johnny Johnny Desmond. Desmond. Whoa. We'll be Googling that all He was the first (laughs) one to sing There (laughs) She Is by by Bernie Wayne. Bernie Wayne wrote that for that show, and then they took it. I tell you, it went when Bert sang. Oh, hey, I mean, there was nothing like, like Ron Ely like, yes. singing it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Tarzan, Tarzan. <laughs> Ladies, and, and we had Mario Lopez this year. Did That's you all know? Yes. They, yes. they did yes. play a recording of Burt Park singing There oh, She Is. Yeah. Look, I got you, to you walk. Come on, that Mario Harry, Lopez doesn't you know. even have to talk. He's Ladies, I told you when they would word it as well. Well, we also, we can do it for hours, but please do this. We have a very special presentation because, you know, we're celebrating former Miss America's current. We also have future. Miss Debbie, <laughs> with a oh, future Miss you. America, a little onesie oh. for your new baby. Oh. Yes, girl. Right. Thank you. <laughs> She'll welcome. wear it. She'll win her own crown. Mommy wow. won't share. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies, thank you so much, Lee Merriweather. Susan George. Phyllis. 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 Oh, you're I'm, just I'm, all I'm reading off of the prompter. Yeah. Phyllis, 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 I know Phyllis. I know Phyllis. Susan Bowles and Katie Stanton. You will never live that down. Thank you.